Right now, Shannon KCPD says that they are using every resource at their disposal. The medical examiner working to determine the age, the gender, and just how long this little baby was dead in the woods. And this comes as neighbors in the area say they're shocked, they're scared, but they're not surprised. This is the location where a neighbor in this community made a heartbreaking discovery. Police called to this wooded area just before 8 Saturday evening on a report of a dead body. When they got here is when they realized that body, a kid, but not just a kid, a little baby. Today on Mother's Day, there's at least one mother who is without their baby. And um, those people know who they are. This is obviously a, a situation we want to um, devote every resource we have to, uh, to figuring out no matter what the explanation is. At this hour, police are working in conjunction with the medical examiner's office, hoping to figure out the age, gender, and just how long this baby was dead in these woods. There's a whole bunch of homeless camps back there. Lori Jaster's home not only backs up to the woods, but the wooded area also sits adjacent to her home. While she's shocked and scared, Jaster says she's not surprised. There's multiple homeless camps back there, multiple. Um, I, we see people walk in and out of those woods with like buggies and wagons, like carrying stuff. I mean, it's, if you go look back there, I mean, there's like couches back there. KCPD says this case will present some real tests for them due to the nature of the case and with how young this baby is, stressing the critical need for the public's help so that they can get the answers they need. It's, it's as big a challenge as any, any case I can think of. Without somebody coming forward, um, it's, it, it's, hard to, it's hard to quantify how big of a challenge it is. Again, Sergeant Bikina says your help, the public's help, is absolutely vital in this case. If you have any information that can help police, you're asked to reach out to the tips hotline. That's 816-474-TIPS. Again, I will repeat that number for you, 816-474-8477. As the sergeant puts it, someone has to speak for this little baby because it can't speak for itself. Shannon.